All right, hi guys, we are on lesson 118, side A. So for our name line, it says it wants us to draw a nine centimeter line segment. So we're gonna go ahead and go on the centimeter side of our ruler here and line it up. And then what number are we gonna start, stop at if it says nine centimeters? Yes, at the nine. So I'm gonna go ahead and actually go to my nine and then draw up to my zero. Then it says measure my date line in centimeters again. So I'm going to line it up. What did you guys get? Five centimeters is correct. So I'm going to write my name, today's date, which is 4 dash, is it 4 8 today? It is 4-8, but this will be for the 4-9 homework assignment. So, pencils are sold in packages of three. Mrs. Conlon bought seven packages of pencils. Draw a picture to show the packages of pencils. And then it says, what story problem is this? So, first we're going to talk about how many are in each packages. So it says are sold in packages of three. So there are three things in each package. So, and then she bought seven packages. So let's go ahead and just draw seven big circles first. One, two, three, four, five. Oop, I'm running out of room. Six and seven, and then it wants me to draw three things in each package, so I'm just gonna do three lines. All right, then it says, what type of problem is this? So what are we putting these in? Groups, right? And is each group have the same amount? Yes, so the type of story problem this is called is an equal, Groups, equal groups, better known as multiplication. So it says, how many pencils did she buy? Let's do our number sentence. We have seven packages times, how many pencils were in each group? Three. equals, now we have to do seven times three. So let's go ahead and count that out. So I have three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21. So seven times three is 21. And we're gonna do 21 pencils and 21 pencils. I'm actually gonna switch to a pencil because I think my crayon with my writing is getting a little sloppy. All right, so now it says, number two, circle the perpendicular line segment. So if you watched the previous video on activity uh, master 118, we talked about perpendicular line segments are lines that meet at a right angle or 90 degrees. So let's go ahead and look. Does this meet at a right angle? Nope. Does this meet at a right angle? Let's check. Oh, and the way to check, remember, we learned with our line segment is we can fit our ruler or a piece of paper perfectly on two sides. So yes, that one fits. Let's check this one. Yep. Yep. Yes and yes. Let's see if this one fits on two sides. Ooh, does my other side fit? No. Let's try this one. Does that one fit? Yes, it does. All right, number three. How many small squares are in this rectangle? So let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight squares. Now it says color one square. What is the fractional part of the rectangle that is colored? So how many did we color in? 
one, and my part always goes on top. How many do I have total? We just added it up, eight. So this fraction is called one eighth. All right, number four, round each number to the nearest 10. Now this is the one